it's no one at the moment. We shall see. Fenris. Oh, I've achieved maximum friendship now, I think. FPS drops. For no reason. Oh, come on. You know, you could go anywhere you like now. I'm aware of that. Oh, you could become a raider. You could join my crew. The crew of your non-existent ship? <laughs> well, with that attitude, you're never going anywhere, are you? She doesn't understand. Yes, I am free. Denarius is dead. Yet, it doesn't feel like it should. Uh, you aren't happy? Seems like you should be dancing for joy. I would have thought so. I thought if I didn't need to run and fight to stay alive, I would finally be able to live as a free man does. But how is that? Whatever past I had died with my sister. I have nothing now. Not even an enemy. You have a future. Maybe that just means there's nothing holding you back. Hmm. An interesting thought. It's just... difficult to overlook the stain that magic has left on my life. If I seem bitter, it's not without cause. Perhaps it is time to move forward. I just don't know where that leads. Do you? If it magic is a fault. You're still blaming magic for everything. Think about it, Hawk. Look at what happened to your mother. Look at the life you've had to lead. Is there anyone whose life has been touched by magic that actually benefits? Uh, it's not simple. Blaming magic isn't the answer. For every mage such as you, Hawk, there are a dozen more too weak to handle their power. Them, I fear, as should you, as should anyone. But what's important now is moving forward. I only wish I knew where that led. Uh, so many possibilities. You want the answer right now? That would spoil all the fun. The future of a slave is never uncertain. But I am no longer a slave. Perhaps it is time I remember that. Thank you, Hawk. I would never have thought to call a mage my friend. Yet here you are. Wherever the future leads, I hope it is at your side. Okay. Uh, is that it? Whatever you need, I'm ready to assist. Yeah, is that done? Ba -ba -da -ba -ba -da. Hello. That's a weird fireplace. Is this for me? It's beautiful. Do you know what it is? No, I'm not sure, sure. Well, I thought so right up until you asked me that. It's Sylvanwood. Rare as diamonds. You only find it in very old, very wild places. The carvings tell a story of the betrayal. The dread wolf tricking all the gods away from the world. I mean, story. Start at the beginning. What happened to the gods? Long ago, there were two clans of gods. The creators looked after the people. The forgotten ones preyed upon us. And one god who was neither. Fan Harrell, the dread wolf. He was kin to the Creators, and in the old days often helped them in their endless war against the Forgotten Ones. What changed? I assume he got tired of helping. That he did. Van Harrel was clever. He could walk among both clans of gods without fear, and both believed he was one of them. He went to each side, and told them the other had forged a terrible weapon, a blade that would end the war. He told the Creators it was forged in the heavens, and the Forgotten Ones 
that it was hidden in the abyss. And when the gods went seeking it, he sealed them both in their realms forever. Now he alone is left in the world. Huh. So the ring has meaning. I imagine the Dalish don't depict the doom of their gods just for decoration. Not... exactly, no. This was made for a keeper, you see. Guarding a clan from the Dread Wolf. Is a keeper's place. It's a... very sweet memento, thank you. Plus 50. Gone on six years in this place, and I still can't fix the holes in the roof. Yep. What got left? That and that one. I must care. Let's do it as well as. It's Captain Isabella and. Is he cocks? Which friend? Did he curl your toes, dwarf your beard, float your frigate, shank your jewelry, grey your warden, or did he cup your joining? Yes, all right. He's an incredibly proficient lover. Happy? Well, that's rather personal, don't you think? <laughs> Have you located any canary blades? There you go. This is what I found. If you find more. Bring them to me. Off to the blooming groves. You have such pretty hair. That's his room over there. Are you ready? Yes, I think so. Such pretty hair. Now, this needs to be convincing. And you'll need to get creative. Call me names, even hit me. Stick with it, no matter what I do. Velasco's a clever son of a bitch. If you waver, he'll notice. You seem a little eager. I'm worried about you. You're enjoying this a little too much. I am, aren't I? <laughs> Whatever you do, just make sure he takes me to Castillon. I'll leave a trail for you to follow. Let's go. I'll be out here. Yell if you need me. Knock, knock. What? Get back here, you... Skitty speech. I hope you have a good reason for interrupting my private time. I brought you a new plaything. She's much less timid. Are you insane? Surprise. You should see the look on your face. This wasn't the plan. We were going to kill him. Change of plans. Remember that time you ran off with the Tome of Coslin? This is like that. Only funnier. 
You backstabbing little shit. You'd better start sleeping with one eye open. Where well, these guys come from? Castillo will be pleased. He's been looking for Isabella for some time. A token of our appreciation. It's more than she is worth. Let's find Isabella's trail and get her back before something nasty happens. Yeah, we can bring someone else along. Uh, sure, I'll find It later. I was thinking of changing my clothes. The twins. This belongs to Isabella.
Ask if I can get from it instantly heals me. that just to get that. Here we go. Why don't we work something out? If you're good, I'll tell Castillo to go easy on you. <laughs> Contrary to popular belief, I do have standards. You're going to do whatever I want. I own you. You sure about that? You! I knew the bitch was up to something! Kill them! It's kind of funny that uh, they let her keep her weapons. Make her give us strength! Ah! I didn't despair, I'm gonna say. Velasco sent word to Castillo. He's on his way. Let's look around first. I want to know why he's in Kirkwall. Dion's looking to expand his slaving business. Why am I not surprised? These documents should go to the guard. We'll at least arrest his accomplices. Quick save. And Velasco told me you were all tied up. A lovely present just waiting to be opened. A few dogs, sir. I see he's paid for that little mistake. What a pretty smear he makes. Well played, Isabella. Crossed and double crossed. You want to talk? Maybe we should talk about these documents. Slavery in the free marches? They're not going to like that. Get to the point. Give me your ship and your word to leave me alone, and you can take these papers and go. Hmm. What's his word worth? Can you trust him? He trades people for money. Castillon's a businessman, and this is a business deal. He'll keep his end of the bargain. Don't you want to kill him? If you want the ship, can't we just kill him and take it? You don't just kill a man and take his ship. That's crude and amateurish. How will he tell everyone how I bested him if he's dead? Huh. It's gone into you. Are you insane? I want his ship. I saw her docked in the harbor. She's new. Fast, and I want her. Give me the documents, and you can have the ship. And you will never hear from me again. Swear it. I swear it on my mother's grave. Give me the documents. <sighs> Sorry, Isabella, but I detest slavers. Castillon dies here today. 
if I have anything to say about it. <laughs> Enough with the blackmail, then. Let's settle this like civilized people. Wait! Shit, wrong button. Crap. <laughs> Meant to click crush in prison, that's like a. supposed to do with these useless documents I hate to state the obvious but I could use them fine take the blasted things go dispense justice or whatever after all we've been through together how could you do that to me quite easily uh, remember the time you ran off with the relic <laughs> You're not still using that as an excuse, are you? Oh, Hawk. <laughs> Castillon deserved what he got, didn't he? I really hate it when you're right. Okay. Oh, she got some blood. Slave is a dead one. It's kind of funny we come out of that door again. Good. I 
wanted to talk to you. Don't you have a funeral to attend? What? You mean Castillons? <laughs> I hope the cleansing blaze of the funeral pyres rejects his vile, sagging ass. Anyway, I'm glad you're here. Saves me the trouble of having to go look for you. I wanted to thank you for everything you've done for me. I'm glad you walked in here all those years ago. I couldn't help myself. I was drawn in by the intoxicating aroma of stale piss and vomit. <laughs> <laughs> it's funny. Now that I think about it, getting a ship just doesn't seem that important. I just hate to have to say goodbye. You're the best friend I've had in... in a very long time. <laughs> a toast to friendship and to us. Go. Stay over there. I once knew a sailor like you. We lost him in a hurricane. Very sad. Uh. Night commander. Okay. <coughs> we did coast it is. Hold there! Who are you? The name's Evitz. As in Evitz Marauders. The folk you killed a few years back. Now you're going to die for what you've done. Uh... I don't remember. Oh. Well. Free rangers and uh, melee. Are you loyal, Prince? Guard captain? To Kirkwall, are you loyal? You're set on a title in Starkhaven, but we're having a crisis here. This isn't just a Kirkwall concern. If this chaos spreads, Starkhaven will need a strong ruler to beat back the tide. I've seen greater men than you use that excuse. Noted and ignored, captain. On here. You it. there. Did my love send you? Will you take me to him? Uh, your father sent me. I come at your father's request. You expected someone else. Fainriel, the man of my dreams. These brutes intended to take my maidenhood. As they argued about who would go first, I fainted. What? Then Fainriel spoke to me in a vision and told me not to fear. When I awoke, the men had slain one another. Wow. Please take me to Fainriel. I want to thank him properly. You could thank me instead, baby. Uh, I don't know where he is. I'm sorry, but I have no way to locate him. Hey! What did you teach him, old man? I'll kill you till you're good and dead. The fuck? <laughs> kill you, bitch! Hey! I'll kill you! Hey! God. I've never experienced this glitch before. Damn, exploded. It seems I must wait a bit longer for my love. Oh, thank you for your aid. I will find my way back to Kirkwall. The walk will time, and we'll be reunited in my dreams. Fainriel, my love, I'm coming. Huh. Don't recall them in there. Oh, he died with his feet stuck in the ground. 
as per usual. Another quest that I've never seen from my other playthroughs for this game far. Oh, hello. Oh, Even over there, Sebastian. Can you open this, Sebastian? Perhaps someone else can. Son of a bitch. Heal, Cliff, I'm just active, Shell, Gun of Mana. Okay. 